Hi, my name is Katie and today I'm going to be doing the repeater build. Here I have the Raspberry Pi 2 with a wireless network adapter and the camera. Here I have the distance sensor. Because this build will take so long, I'm going to do a time lapse. We had to stop the time lapse because we hit a problem. The problem was in step 53 where you use the repair reward to power on the servos to set their initial positions. We started using these new Amazon NIMH batteries, but the motors kept moving randomly. We switched to the recommended batteries, Analoops, and charged them and they were showing 1.39 volt, volts each. It improved, but there is still some random movements. Then, we tried cleaning the contacts with deoxit. Better, but still some movement. So, we tried using a DC power supply. This is an old ATX computer power supply, rated for 14 amps at 12 volts. That seems to work a lot better, but there is still some, ran some small random movements every few seconds. This is as good as we're going to get, so we're going to continue the build. This is the build finished. You can turn him on and his eyes light up. I haven't put the Raspberry Pi in yet. The first thing I need to do is hook him up to a computer and set the trim and test that everything works. Now I have the trim set. It wasn't that hard and it only took a few minutes. It helps to have a ruler or straight edge to align the feet. It is now running off of analog batteries and it is connected to the computer. The computer is using Arduino IDE. Now let's see it move. I've now got him hooked up to the Arduino serial monitor. There are 10 commands. Now I'm going to show them. This one will stretch out his right hand. This 
one will wave his left hand. This one will grip both hands. This one will wave right hand. This one will wave both hands. This one will turn left. Okay, this one will turn right. will make him walk forwards. This one will make him walk backwards. And this one will make him stop. I still haven't installed the Raspberry Pi yet. I also want to install microphone and speakers. We can do some really cool stuff with the Rapiro. Subscribe to my YouTube channel to see the upcoming videos on the Rapiro.